hello hello good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you're watching me from my name is adora and on today's edition of adora zone we'll be talking about how to learn new skills from youtube for free absolutely for free anyway i hope you all enjoyed your christmas celebrations i hope you're enjoying today's boxing day celebration and i hope we all enjoy our new year celebrations and many more to come all right um if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel i please 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 i plead with you subscribe share my videos out so that people like you can also watch and learn a thing or two from my videos thank you very much all right you know there, there are so many skills you want to learn you might want to learn or you have interest in but you really don't know how to go about it because you're looking for someone to teach you you're looking for someone you're gonna pay your hard-earned money and learn it from do you know the secrets to saving your money from learning a new skill is all there on the internet it's all there on youtube you can learn different skills for free on youtube like when i mean for free i mean absolutely for free there are so many skills you see you I, you actually think oh how am i going to be able to do this how am i going to be able to learn this who's going to teach me how am i going to get money to pay for this but when you go on youtube every quest every answer to every question you want is there like just go on youtube and it, you can just press the how do i make my head rotate and go 360 degrees 24 hours you will actually watch it there you will see someone doing it there on youtube you see a lot of ridiculous videos you see a lot of funny things you feel a lot of funny ideas you actually see things you don't even expect to see people do but you know what there are people that are interested in watching them do that so definitely there is market for everyone the sky is big enough for everyone to, to you know to fly in so on today's edition i'll be explaining exactly why you should save your money to learn that skill hmm. some months back i learned how to bake cake from youtube for free like i'm the kind of person i I used to be that kind of person. I didn't really have any interest in learning a skill. I just felt it's for lazy people. Like, I don't know, but I just, I never really saw learning a skill, you know, like an important thing. I didn't see it like something I should even make money from. I just felt it should be a hobby, a side hobby or something. But recently I've just come to understand that, listen, the world in which we're entering now, it's either you learn a skill you must have something to add to what you're already doing. You can't depend on one income alone. You should have a side hustle. No matter, even if it's one or two side hustles, you want to add to what you're already doing. But just have something. And then even if you don't want to learn a skill or to, to have a skill for the monetary benefit, at least even if you want to do it because you just want a hobby or just something to while away time, whatever it is you want to do, it's done on YouTube. I learned how to bake cake on YouTube. I have never baked in my life. I have never even mixed a flour to say I want to bake cake. I think the only time I actually mixed the flour was when I wanted to make pancake. And apart from that, that's it. But I learned how to make, to bake cake on YouTube. Like, you know, the process was actually very, very easy. And I was like, is this all? Is this what I have actually not learned all this while? And I was like, thank God I didn't even pay someone to teach me this thing. Because that would have been a total waste of money. The whole thing was so easy. Like, so so easy it was really really easy and after i baked my first cake it tasted so nice you know i had to put this though this one i put was not part of the video i watched from youtube but i just put like a small um what was this called coconut um oil just to bring out a little bit of coconut flavor from the cake and it tasted really really superb so and when i finished i was so proud of myself that wow so i actually learned how to do this without paying a dime Yes, it's very possible. You can learn any skill on YouTube without paying a dime. Okay, then at some point too, I said, okay, fine. I know how to make hair, but I'm not very good when it comes to, you know, like, you know, the, the roots. You make hair and the roots will be so, it will be, it will be so smooth and it will be so nice. And when someone looks at it, it looks like, wow, this is professionally done. I wasn't, my, my, my hands were not so strong, like to kind of hold my hair from the scalp. But when I watched a few YouTube videos, I actually saw how to make it so clean and neat and you know i kind of upgraded my hair plating skills all from youtube at no cost and then recently i was just talking to my brother and we're talking about something he's very good at he's into it so we're talking about graphic designs and all that and then when he dropped the phone i just kind of 
piqued interest, you know. Mind you, I have never done anything about graphic design before. I have no idea where to start from. All I know about the internet is just to check my mails, read and do the normal Facebook, just normal surfing and all that. But I have never really gone deep to do all those very, very core IT things. So I just went on YouTube and I typed how to learn graphics design, how to look, how to create logos for you no know, business logos and all that. And I watched it. I watched two videos. I try as much as possible to watch two or three videos so I can compare and pick the ideas I want from each one. And I watched these videos and I was like, wow, um, doesn't really look as difficult as I thought. So I went ahead. I downloaded this app called PixArt. PixArt. I downloaded it. And before I downloaded PixArt, I had already I had already one um, app I had on my phone. I had this the app on my phone for a very long time. And do you know what? I have never really given it a thought. I didn't even know what that app was for, but it's just there on my phone. It's called Logo Maker. So when I downloaded PixArt, I remember that I have something also called Logo Maker. And then I went on to Logo Maker on my phone and I tried to play along with it and just see what it could bring me. And I discovered that you could use it to create your YouTube thumbnails. You could use it to create your business card, to create your flyers anything at all you could do with it so i said okay i've done i've tried logo maker let me now try the pixart and then i kind of played around pixart and i discovered it was even i kind of preferred it more you know because it was a bit more vast with lots of free um, features in it lots of free pictures lots of free videos and the guidance was really really easy it was very easy to manipulate around so i was like wow okay let me see what i could do with it and i was trying and within three hours i was able to create my first logo my first logo and it came out pretty nice anyway and then i kept you no, know, doing more and more and instead I, I kept practicing i kept practicing i kept practicing and i was like jesus christ just imagine if i had to go and learn this thing from someone because do you know right now there is this um online um um site called fiverr where people actually trade their skills for money so whatever skill you have you go onto this app you register and then people who want it from you they actually pay you for you to do it so let's say right now I'm a graphics designer and I advertise my myself there as a graphics designer and you come on there and say you want me to do one or two things for you, maybe like design a poster or design something. I'll give you my services. You pay me even without seeing me. So that's how it works. And then I went back to YouTube because actually I literally sleep on YouTube every day. I watch videos upon videos because I try as much as possible to update myself. I don't want to live in the past. I don't want it to look like the world is moving forward and I'm just there stuck. So I watched a video about a young girl. This girl is just 12 years old. And um, she said she made her first $20 per hour from a logo she created for someone on Fiverr. She is now um, working on Fiverr, you know, selling her services to people. Can you imagine? You just sit down in the comfort of your home and you create a logo effortlessly and sell it to someone for $20. Like, that was the first one she did. And that was when she was just starting out. So just imagine by now, maybe she's now a pro in it and then maybe she must have upped her fees a bit and... You know, these things are actually very important to learn. And she actually, she didn't even learn it from anybody. She, she said she went, the same YouTube, she went on YouTube, she learned these things, she bought a laptop and boom. That was how she started making money from it. So it's not every time you have to pay, pay, pay. It's not every time you have to spend your money. Because some of the people that are actually teaching you, some people that actually teach you, they learn these things from some other people. Some people learn it from YouTube. And then they will learn from YouTube for free and they will come and teach you and get money from you. So why don't you save that money? You go to YouTube and learn it. It's as, it's as easy as that. Don't waste your money unless, unless you know that that skill is very, very, very unavoidably. You can't, you can't just, you can't like avoid paying a fee for it unless you know it's something that you must, or maybe because you need a certificate for it, a hard copy certificate. But apart from that, if it's something you just want to teach yourself, it, maybe you want it, like I said, if for a side hustle, or just for the fun of learning a new skill go on youtube make good use of youtube if you have to spend one hour on youtube like every day to learn a particular skill it's worth it invest that time on it learn it because right now things are changing 
The world is actually, you know, changing. Everything is moving so fast. Don't be left behind. Don't wait for people to teach you everything. I remember years back, many, many years back, when I was still in Nigeria, I actually had interest in learning um, events management. You know, this events management, how to, to um, decorate wedding halls and all that. I actually wanted to. So I went to this lady who does it. She teaches how to, to, to do events management and all that, whatever. So I paid, I actually paid, at that time, I paid this amount of money, which I didn't have. Well, I had to go and look for this money because I really wanted to learn this thing. So I had to go and look for this money. I scratched every little penny I had, put them together and paid this woman. But you know what this woman actually does? She will come to class. She will just teach me for like 10 minutes and then the rest is practicals. And then she's so fast that you, you know, you try to catch up with her, but she was so fast. And after one month, honestly, I didn't really understand anything, but I just felt, well, let me just move along with what I've had. But the money she took from me times the money she must have taken from every other person. Just imagine how much this woman was making at that point. So why don't you save your money? Invest that money in your data, internet data. Go on YouTube and learn your skills for free. It's what, what, what it. Do not waste money learning something you can actually afford to get for free. It's not worth it. Except, like I said before, except you know you cannot afford not to pay the money. Maybe because you need a hard copy, you need a certificate for it, or you need you know something to show that you actually learned the skill. Apart from that, YouTube is your friend.